this should be, uh, yes, it is, Chell Lindgren floating into the field of view as uh, the three crew members uh, prepare uh, to move their, uh, to move into the Soyuz vehicle and close the hatch uh, to mark uh, the end of their stay on board the International Space Station. The crew uh, saying uh, farewell to one another, obviously uh, wishing uh, the departing crew soft landings. The uh, hatch uh, between uh, Rosviet and the Soyuz vehicle closed at 9 32 a.m. Moscow time, 12.32 a.m. Houston time for the remainder of the day through its landing on the steppe of Kazakhstan. This is Mission Control Houston. Uh, video now being received from the landing site to the northeast of Jezkazgan. A good view of uh, Kimia Yui, who's uh, being hoisted uh, in his uh, reclining chair. The um, extraction of the crew is, is in progress, with uh, Kononenko and Yui having been extracted and uh, Chell Lindgren now in the process of being extracted as well. And a good view of Chell Lindgren uh, having returned uh, from space 141 days on his first mission. Just two days ago, he was at the controls at the robotics workstation in the cupola of the International Space Station using the Canadarm2 robotic arm to grapple uh, the orbital ATK Cygnus resupply vehicle. And 48 hours later, he's back on Earth with his crewmates, Oleg Kononenko and Kamiya Yui. Now Lindgren uh, being lifted uh, to be carried uh, to an all-terrain vehicle and a short ride uh, to a, a nearby helicopter uh, to begin the flight uh, back to Jezkazgan.